Chanting, it's our right to have education, work and security. These Afghan women are making a bold statement. With women's rights unsure under Afghanistan's new Taliban leadership, they're worried the country is set to regress to its repressive past. As the Taliban prepare its new government, the protesters are demanding women are allowed to participate. Since the Taliban fell in 2001, women have had opportunities that were unimaginable under the group's rule, including holding political office and joining the military and police forces. و حضور زنان را در کابینه حکومتشان حتمی بدانند اگر ما متوجه هستیم که تعداد بیشتر جمعیت افغانستان زنان شکل میده when the taliban last ruled afghanistan women were barred from working outside the home or even from leaving the house without a male guardian girls weren't allowed to go to school and police flogged those who violated so-called morality rules this time around, the Taliban appear to be trying to present a more moderate face to the world. The group has pledged that no violence or prejudice against women will be allowed, but insists that women will be bound by what it terms Islamic law, a lack of clarity that's left many in the country worrying about an uncertain future and a loss of hard-fought gains.